Wildfires are spreading across the western United States and Canada. Over 170 fires were burning in the Canadian western province of Alberta on Thursday. Thousands of residents have been under evacuation orders in the region since last week. Here in the United States, nearly 90 wildfires are burning, covering over 1.6 million acres. More than 40 of those fires are burning in the states of Oregon and Washington. The Durkee Fire in Oregon is the largest in the country, having burned more than 268,000 acres. That's nearly double the size of the city of Chicago. Meanwhile, the Park Fire in Northern California has burned over 71,000 acres. Jonathan Vigliotti joins me now from Chico, California. Jonathan, what's the latest with the fire? Yeah, John, good evening to you. Tonight, more than a dozen homes look like this one, charred down to their foundations as the flames quickly swept in. This evening, we're told more than 1,100 firefighters are now here battling this blaze, and they have their work cut out for them. We're told that the flames have now progressed into remote, rugged terrain, that firefight complicated by triple-digit heat, high wind, and all of that bone-dry vegetation. It is incredible to think just 24 hours ago, this fire was just a brush fire that overnight then exploded into a 70,000 acre monster. Hard to put out then, difficult to put out now as fire crews are working overhead and on the ground. Thousands of people still under that mandatory evacuation that was set into place yesterday. And we're learning this evening there is now an investigation into a 42-year-old Chico man who was taken into custody for possible arson. Fire crews were alerted to him by several eyewitnesses. We actually spoke with one of those eyewitnesses who described his actions more as negligence, saying he was driving his car erratically, drove into a ditch, and then spun his tires to try to get out, the friction from doing so, creating sparks, marking that fire, making that master blaze that we're now dealing with today. The investigation continues, and that firefight continues as well. The high winds continue to be an issue this evening, John. Jonathan Bigliani in Chico, California. Thank you very much, Jonathan.